big and little. <laughs> Rick's got her big, go. juicy yeah. track suit. I, I wish it said juicy on the butt. Here we go. We're spring chickens this morning. We are ready. We're headed to Aspen. So excited. I was really proud of myself and thought I packed a carry on and they told me it was too big. You tried though. So I, I really tried. Like, just wish I w might as well have brought a bigger suitcase. Yeah. But it's okay. We're in line for Starbucks. We're flying to Charlotte and then from Charlotte to Phoenix and from Phoenix to Aspen. So I've never done that either. Never done that either. First time for everything. Gals on the go. <laughs> Love it. Got some magazines for the plane ride and. Is this Lord? Yeah, it's Lord. Oh. And some bubble mint gum. Just really just doing the most today. Brooke is giving me life right now. <laughs> Running to our next flight. Made it to Phoenix. We have one more flight to catch. The last one we literally rushed there. They were about to close the gate in 40 seconds, but we were waiting for our Bojangles. It was a whole thing. Story coming on the podcast for sure. Mood booster right here. Watermelon in a cup. We got more coffee. One more flight to go, then we're in Colorado. Now here's the real kicker. Did the bags make it? I have to manifest positive thoughts. Yeah. So I, I know what tragedy would be if like yours got here and mine didn't. Oh my, <laughs> vice versa. Yay, both of our bags made it. Let's go. Oh my gosh, you guys. So Brooke and I got our own rooms actually. We just checked into the W Hotel in Aspen. This is so sick. Oh my gosh, more lights just turned on. Here's the bathroom. And then look guys, bunk bed. There are so many beds, I could have a whole party in here. This is so sick though. Oh my gosh, literally all for me. They gave us some goodie bags when we got here, so I thought I'd open them on camera. So the brand we're here with is called Aprico, and they are launching on October 6th. So it's very exciting, I'm really happy to be here for the launch. Small but mighty supplement blends that increase absorption by five to 25 times. Hi Danielle, welcome to Aspen. We're so excited for you to learn more about Aprico this week and immerse yourself in our Colorado lifestyle. Here are a few goodies to get you started, including our immunity shot, hydrate and replenish sachets, and broad spectrum hemp drops. You'll learn more about these and our other products over the next few days. All right, let's see. Oh my gosh, a little Aprico sports bra hair ties because we have a Pilates class tomorrow. Oh my gosh, Air One antibacterial spray. This is that really fancy um, grocery store in LA. I don't really know how this works, but it's a little hydrate thing. Broad spectrum hemp drops. Immunity shot. I love immunity shots. You guys know I'm always here for that. Oh my gosh. How cute. Vibe. Oh, we love an itinerary. And then a water bottle. This is honestly such a perfect hotel to like come and go s snow skiing with all your buddies. You know, you just get one room. This is honestly genius. I'm sure this is mainly a ski resort during the winter time. I've actually never been skiing, fun fact. So maybe I'll have to come back and stay here. I was just decompressing for a little bit. I'm gonna get ready for the evening. So we're currently missing the cocktail hour, which I'm sad about, but I wanted to have some time to kind of charge my social battery and get ready because we got here a little bit later than some of the other gals. Um, I'm so excited to meet everybody and like see who else is on this trip. But the important thing is my bag didn't get lost. The most aesthetic bathroom and I love how they've loaded us up with waters. This is mine from the airport. They said to drink lots of water, stay very hydrated so we avoid altitude sickness. So thankfully we're here with a wellness brand and they gave us obviously immunity shots and stuff. So I'm feeling good. We're gonna thought we'd be rooming together but we get our own little bathroom. So I'm gonna hopefully look a lot better next time you guys see me. Oh baby. The shower literally smells like eucalyptus. I am in heaven. It's only appropriate to play this playlist as I get ready. I feel 10 times cuter and I'm so happy to be in fall attire, you guys. So here is the full fit. This is a long sleeve bodysuit from Free People. I will link it below if I can find it. This jacket is from Lamarck off of Revolve. I love it. I just know it's gonna be a big layering piece for me this fall. Pants are the Aritzia Molina pants. They're just some 
black pants, very fun. And then I'm just wearing my Mark Fisher booties. Also just Dyson air wrapped my hair. Let's get started with the evening. Got a iced cappuccino. Her view is absolutely gorgeous. Oh my gosh, imagine this in the winter. So cute, we can journal out here in the morning. So cute, the pants. I'm still getting dressed. I love it. Turtleneck moment. It's so fun to dress in fall clothes again. I know, it's kind of fun. It's very empowering. Got a good old Corona. Brooke got a Pinot or Sauvignon Blanc. Savvy, Savvy B. Oh, she looks so cute. We're taking some pictures. Cheers. We've been talking with the brand team. This is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I'm in heaven. Made it to dinner. This town is so cute. I got so many beverages. Love it. Good night, buddy. It was a great day. See you guys. We sleep on our separate rooms with separate bunk beds. It was such a nice dinner, getting to know everybody. Yum, love. We have sleep drops. We just took the hydrate drops. They were like very salty because they have electrolytes in them. Yes. So I feel like we're gonna wake up feeling great. Brooke almost fainted from altitude <laughs> sickness. Um, we will be talking about that on the podcast, but they kept telling us like they kept saying it. Drink water, drink like, water. Please drink water, please. I was like, I drank like, enough water. <laughs> I know. It wasn't enough. enough. Oh, but we're at like eight thousand feet right now. Which I don't really understand how. I know. Because like for another day, I guess. For another day, but anyways. Anyways, bye buddy. Bye buddy. See you later. See you in the morning. Just got back to my room and they had some of these sleep easy drops on my pillow, which is amazing. So tired, you guys, it's like one or 2 a.m. our time. I think I'm gonna sleep in this bed tonight. <laughs> I'm trying to decide, but this one's closest to the bathroom. It seems nice and cozy. This place is so cool though. I'm so excited for tomorrow. We're doing all kinds of fun things. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning. It's 7.45, ordered room service. We have a workout and there's like a light breakfast after, but you guys know me, I need breakfast when I wake up. So I got this. Morning guys, we're getting ready for mountaintop Pilates. I am so nervous. I'm so excited to be on top of a mountain. Um, and they're giving us smoothies beforehand, which is awesome. But I am so scared. I'm not good at Pilates. Um, but it's gonna be great. We're all in this together. Layering up. I've got this black set active set on and then just this black Lululemon long sleeve. All right, we are ready for the day. All black. And then I'm wearing this brown puffer jacket from Princess Polly. Hopefully this is warm enough. It's like 50, so I don't think it's that bad. It's gonna be a little chillier up there, but and then I've got this bag. If you guys remember, I wore it to Lala. Um, and then I didn't bring real sneakers because I'm dumb, so. Air Force Ones, <laughs> I'm so prepared. In general, I'm just very not prepared for this um, trip, but that's okay. Got some morning smoothies. I got mango, pineapple, and kale. This looks like a yeah. <laughs> laptop background. It does. Wow, <laughs> so beautiful. I think I need some vitamins or some shots. Awesome. Daily vitamin, thank you. <laughs> Fast and slow, I don't care. I don't care. Yep. Wow. All right, grab your hand. Put it just <laughs> below <laughs> your knee. This view is unreal. We're headed down the mountain now. So good. We just got down the mountain. We're walking through the town. I wish I had time to change, but we don't. We're gonna go. We have to get. We're gonna get some caffeine, like a light bite. A light bite. A light bite for recording. And we're gonna get nice and fueled up. We were craving soup, and they literally have it. Getting chicken noodle soup, baguette. Oh, we're gonna have. Oh, this is the cutest little bakery. Our hotel's right over there. Just what we needed, just what the doctor ordered. This is a dream. Chicken noodle soup with a French baguette. Chicken noodle soup. With the soda on the side, you know that, oh my gosh, so good. So we just got back, we got some chicken noodle soup. I got a cappuccino on our way out, this super cute little French bakery. I'm so happy we found it. I think that's where our smoothies were from this morning. I'm about to go over to Brooke's room to record a podcast. We're, we're doing an intro. We're actually having Violet Benson on the podcast this week. Um, we already interviewed her, it was such a fun episode. But we want to record the intro for in real time because if you guys don't know, I have a podcast with Brooke. It's called Gals on the Go. And uh, 
we like to make it super real time so we can talk about things that happened that week and I think you guys really enjoy that. But yeah, I'm just feeling like a little blah because the altitude, I told you guys last night, Brooke almost passed out and I thought I was fine. I've been drinking so much water, but today at the workout, I just simply could not give it up my all. Brooke and I were both kind of like, holy crap. I don't know if it's like the high altitude. We were at like 11,000 feet and then doing Pilates. I also am not a big workout in the morning person. I think I was just anxious because I was really nervous about the workout because I knew how high elevation it was gonna be not like I'm not scared of heights at all, but more so I just knew I was gonna get out of breath and it was not a good workout for me. I was really embarrassed. I literally sat in the back and like didn't do anything. And that's okay. And I shouldn't be embarrassed. And everyone was so nice and so sweet. Like literally do child's pose the whole time. Literally lay down, it's fine. And there were, everyone was having to take breaks because working out at such a high elevation just is a lot. So it was really nice um, and the view was amazing, but I was just so caught up in my own shit that I I couldn't fully enjoy it and I wasn't fully myself, which I hate being when I'm around new people. But recording Gals on the Go always puts me in a good mood and honestly, I think I am just doing a lot right now and you guys know we've talked about social battery. I'm just like, go, go, go. And I think today my body is like, nope. But the good thing is we're here on a wellness trip and they are constantly giving us all kinds of goodies and smoothies. We have free time basically for the rest of the day. And then we have dinner tonight and then we leave tomorrow. But I just thought I'd have this little chatty session with you guys before I go up to Brooke's room. We're gonna literally record in our robes. It's so comfy. I love just being in hotels. It's always fun, so. That's the lowdown, that's the update. Gals who record in robes, in robes stay. Gals on the out. <laughs> Love this energy, this is great. The energy's right. Live from Aspen, it's Gals yes. on the go. Hello you. <laughs> we just got pre-dinner room service. We were so hungry. Cause we're our body clock, I think it's still on East Coast time. So it's like dinner time for us. So we got mac and cheese drum. <laughs> That was, doing was work, watching YouTube videos together. It's so fun. <laughs> I love it. I love just hanging out in hotel rooms. It's so nice. Me too. Hotel rooms are oh, such a pleasure in life. Oh. You know, altitude is real though. Yeah. We've been shrugging <laughs> feet. I'm gonna try to, my goal is before I stand up to finish this. Before you stand up? Yeah. I plan to keep sitting for a little <laughs> bit longer. <laughs> so much fun. She tank. Broke the tank. <laughs> We're going to this really cool place for cocktails called J Bar. Apparently it's like this really iconic spot um, in Aspen. And then, oh, I just have the camera strap. She's like, don't look now, but you got the camera strap in the way. <laughs> Don't look now. And then we're going to the French Alpine Bistro for dinner. Oh my god, my grandma just texted me. Sweetheart, are you in Aspen actually? I know, my, my grandma was so confused. confused. I don't know if I ever replied. Reply to Grammy. All right, I was just updating you guys. Um, we did some work outside, but then got a little chilly. And that's all I got for you. The episode's good. Go listen to Gals on the Go. I've become obsessed with sparkling water. I asked if they had LaCroix. They did not, but they had San Pellegrino. Just got back from Brooke's room. Let's get ready for dinner. Filming my outfit in here because the lighting by the mirror is really weird. This top is just a long sleeve top from I think Nordstrom last year or the year before. Jeans, I'll link them down below. They're from Citizens of Humanity. They're my new straight leg jeans. Blazer is from Urban Outfitters. It's from the brand Lioness. Boots from last night. Same bag. So yeah, we're going to this place called J Bar and then French Alpine Bistro. So I'm gonna go Meet them down in the lobby. Let's go on a little peaceful walk. Yes. We're both wearing almost the same thing. If I was wearing a black jacket, white shirts, blue jeans, black boots, it's just how we do. We never intentionally do it. I was Look just at like the mountains in the background. Yeah, it's so cool. Oh, I feel so nice to be outside. I love the fresh air. So we are cooking our own steak tonight. Brooke and I are little partners here. Oh, oh yes, and then they're cooking their steak. Oh, we're cooking. Like, is it like a s'more? We're gonna, or? Oh, no, there's gonna be a skillet on there Oh, that, that makes hot. so much. I already had my milk chocolate. Brooke's leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving too, I don't know why. We're gonna be without each other for exactly two days. I know. What will we do? I don't know. Brooke's going to Charleston. Charleston. And I'm going back to New York. New York. New York. I'm literally gonna get to see her new apartment and everything. We're helping her move out. It's gonna be so exciting. Food was amazing. We cooked our own steak. And I think we cooked it well enough. I was really nervous about the cooking your own steak. I'm gonna go back to my room. 
get some amazing night's sleep, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Morning, guys. I slept fabulously last night. I decided to put on the TV in bed. It's honestly so cozy. I'm about to order room service. What's new? Brooke said that her flight got canceled, and she was supposed to say this morning. I feel so bad. Um, I'm going to do the two eggs your way, please. Can I do two eggs over medium? Choice of bacon, extra crispy if possible. And then instead of potatoes, can I get the fruit medley by chance? And then um, for toast, I'll have sourdough, please. This is the best morning ever. <laughs> Watching friends and eating food. Love it. He just brought me coffee too on a tray. This is like amazing. All right, we're about to go to the airport, but I want to take some wellness shots before we get on the flight. It's one of my favorite things to do. So they literally are like salty tasting because they have a ton of electrolytes and they're just good to hydrate you. And you guys know I don't really want any more altitude sickness up in here. Um, so we're just gonna hydrate up, cheers. And we're just gonna follow it up with this immunity shot. It's a shot with a dash of elderberry and a splash of lemon. Cheers part two. And now I'm feeling ready for my flight. I'm caffeinated, I am ate my breakfast. I'm in a good headspace for flying to Chicago and then JFK. It's so crazy. Every time I like fly back to New York City, it's so crazy that that, that is home. So I'm thinking to wear this jacket today actually with my airport fit because I'm feeling chic. Here's the airport fit. Tank top is a, a parallel apparel, Alicia and Ashley's line. I'm obsessed with it. I wore the white tank on the way here. Biker shorts are from Revolve. I'll link them down below for you guys. And then the infamous Lamarck jacket that I'm living in. But I did find a dupe for this jacket on Princess Polly for $80. This one's a lot more than that. So I'll link that down below for you guys because you need it in your life. Yeah, okay. I got my suitcase shut, thankfully. Goodbye room. This is the most random room ever, but it's honestly really cool. I love W Hotels in general, so thank you to Aprico for putting us up in here. And yeah, let's start the travel day. Insert travel montage here. Let's go. <laughs> Guys, things are happening. <laughs> Oh Our flight just got delayed like so many times and then they just canceled it. So now the brand is being amazing. They're sending us a van here and we're driving two hours to Grand Junction. Hey, we might have some good views on the drive. Right? Yeah. I and then, wonder if we could ask them to stop for some food. I know. See, I'm just trying to stay positive. Oh, I see the van coming now. Um, road trip with the other girls, too. We'll get to see them all again. Yay. We didn't have to say goodbye to the girlies. Say hi. I know. What's up? <laughs> we get more time. Say oh, hey. Oh, hey. Here we all are, the girlies. Yes, the gals. The gals. So we're at some random cafe. That flight that we were about to go to didn't exist, so we're at a random coffee shop. I got a Caprese Panini and Sprite. Um, we're all just staying calm, you know? We'll get home eventually. So we are still here. We are, but we have a plan in motion, which is the good news. Yes, exactly. We're honestly enjoying the weather, looking at the mountains. It's, it's a so beautiful, beautiful day. It's <laughs> It makes no sense saying that. I know, the flights were all canceled. A lot of you guys are messaging us saying that Aspen, more flights get canceled than go out, which I would believe after today. Um, anyways, we're staying positive. It's all good. Yeah. We just had some lovely lunch. We brought this cute little cafe. Yeah, it's cute. Shout out. <laughs> and uh, we basically are going to be driving four hours to Denver tonight. From Denver, we're flying to Vegas. And then from Vegas to Newark, and we'll get in at 7 a.m. tomorrow. So yeah. now Brooke will not be going to Charleston. She'll be foregoing the fantasy suite. I will be. To Charleston. I. It's. I feel. Oh, it's so sad. sad. There's no flights to Charleston though. Like if I wanted to do that, I wouldn't get there until tomorrow morning, and I'm mostly missing all the things that I would be going for anyway. So it just way, doesn't you, make sense. Yeah. And then I could be there for my move. So she gets to move into her new apartment they tomorrow. So I was gonna do it. So. For some reason, you weren't meant to go to Charleston, I know. which sucks. It's, but in the, it's Mercury retrograde, if you guys didn't know. Yeah, and that's all. Excuse me. And that's all, all you need to know. All so that's the update. Bye, guys. Here we are. We are in Denver. Getting men, were they called Denver Menver? Menver? You know yeah. Are there cute men in Denver? No, because the population of guys to girls is like. There's more guys than girls. Oh, Menver. Hello. Hello. This Menver. airport's really nice. Um, we're flying to Vegas. Gonna do some slots there. Valentina's in the back. 
looking for a restaurant to chill out for a while. Then we'll go to Vegas, and then from Vegas to Newark, and hopefully I will be in my apartment tomorrow morning. I am here for a good travel day, you know? Brooke was supposed to be in Charleston, but I just get to hang out with her more. <laughs> We're not going, baby. We're, We're not going. going. Finally boarding a flight. Thank you. It's magical. We're all in the same row. We're headed to Vegas. Don't text. I know. Vegas, baby. Vegas, baby. I caved and bought a neck pillow. It's the CNN rated it the best travel pillow in 2021. It's the most bulky, ugly one, but it was like you don't want to get the what Valentina got. I know for. Valentina got a cute, sleek one. Yeah. I just I need the big guns. <laughs> Brooke's first time to Vegas. This is. Crazy. Let's get it. I know. Getting sprinkles cupcakes, because why not? kind of legit. Like. Yeah. Sky. Alright, here comes my cupcake. <laughs> oh my god. That right there is worth the five dollars. Like, guys. Oh my god. Fall time. Stop. We both got sprinkles cupcakes. I got Annie's pretzels. And the best part, I didn't want to be cold on this flight. So I was like, I had to buy a sweatshirt. This is the best one. Feeling lucky in Vegas. <laughs> we made it. I am headed into bed for the next few hours. Bags are lost. Or they're not lost, they're found, but they stayed in Vegas. They didn't make it on the plane with us, so. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Love you guys, bye.